My name is Jay Grams. My family has owned the Volo Auto Museum since 1960. We have a few hundred of the most exciting collector cars and they're all for sale in one location. I personally have handpicked them from around the country. Welcome to my sales shop. Come on, let's go for a spin. Hey, we've got a fun car for you. It's a Pontiac historical documented real GTO. It's got the 400, a four speed and a 390 posi rear end. Good, clean, honest car. If you go to volocars.com, you can read my full uh, in inspection report. You can uh, see all the video, or sorry, photos top to bottom and get the price on this car and a few hundred other collector cars that are all for sale at volocars.com. If you like the video, subscribe to our YouTube channel, click on the bell icon. You'll see one or two videos a day as we put them out there. But right now, join me. Let's go for a spin in this GTO. A good, clean, honest car. This is not a nut and bolt off the frame uh, you know, trailer car, but it's a nice, respectable, honest car. The floors are just dry, clean metal, nice braces, nice inner rockers. Even the inner rear quarters are clean. The uh, drain plugs there, the original spot welds are underneath there still showing. I was in the trunk looking. I don't see any cuts or splices. I believe these are the original quarter panels. It's an older paint job, probably 20 years old or better. So there's like a scratch right on the top edge here that's been touched up. Uh, fits square and flush. Look down the sides, this thing's straight. The door fits real nice and square. I noticed way down low, there's one bubble right here. And this is an old paint job. And if that's all you got showing, I'm pretty impressed. All the stainless trim, not brand new, but it's all shiny and it's all straight and it all fits real nice. Nothing's loose, nothing's beat up or uh, scraped up. It all looks nice. Mirror's new, door handles are new. You could get this stripe. This is what they put on the judges, but you could order that stripe uh, separately. I think it dresses it up real nice. This is the original color. I think Warwick blue, if I'm correct. Windshield's new, crystal clear, has a hood tachometer, the correct antenna. Now the rubber bumper on these, uh, they all crack. I've had show cars in here, they crack. So the bumper's in excellent shape. Uh, now without my glasses on, I don't even see the cracks, but there are some hairline cracks in the bumper, in the paint, I should say, not the bumper, and I think it fits exceptionally well. The grills are in excellent condition. The Rally 2 wheels are restored. They're all painted, got the right lug nuts, center caps, trim rings. The tires look like new condition. Vinyl top's excellent, has a nice stance. Uh, it's got uh, like cool marker lights. The rear bumper is re-chromed. The tail lights are excellent. Has the optional exhaust extensions uh, coming out the back there. Uh, inside, it's got a retro stereo fit right in the dash. The original AM radio is included, uh, but this is all real nice. There are some new Kenwood 6x9 speakers. A couple little dimples on this piece of stainless right here. Inside the car, again, honest, clean, not abused interior. The door jam's real nice. This door lip is clean as a whistle. These weather strips are new. The window seals are new. The weather strip up here is uh, actually this side's new and the other side's original. There's cracks on the other side. Why they did one, I don't know. When I say not abused, the door panel's straight. It's not warped, it's not kicked and beat up. The armrests are not cracked. The upholstery's real nice. There's a little nick right here on the seat, but the seat backs, all this plastic trim is not scratched up or uh, beat up. I also just noticed there's one crack on the headrest right there. The dash pad is mint. They always split and warp. This one's mint. Now under the hood is a correct 1969 GTO 400, 350 horsepower. Uh, it's pretty much stock. It is an Edelbrock intake, but they painted it to match the motor, so it blends right in. Other than that, it's got stock valve covers, air cleaner, exhaust manifolds, and it's all clean and tidy. Firewall's mint. All the components on the firewall are clean. Uh, you know, the hoses, the shroud, 
everything's nice. So front and back seats are in really nice shape. Look at what I'm talking about in the door panel. Nothing's warped. The windows just roll up and down smooth. They fit really nice. Clean trunk compartment. Clean metal. I don't see any signs of patches. Uh, no fiberglass, no rust. All clean metal. They gave it a nice coat of spatter finish. They took their time. There's no spatter uh, overspray on the wires or the housings. It's all nice. Bottom of the trunk lid's painted nice. Latch is cleaned up. It has new stickers, new weather strip. So it's a clean trunk compartment. Uh, there's new hood hinges in the box there. I doesn't seem like they need them, but there are new hinges there. Uh, the guy I got it from just put LED interior lights in there. It lights it up nice and white. Uh, there's a gauge cluster below the dash, some really nice looking gauges. And again, the retro stereo is new. You also put a 12 volt receptacle in there. You can plug in your devices. Uh, let me fire it up. It's got a Flowmaster exhaust. Sounds great. Inside the glove box is nice, headliners real nice, visors, the mirror, kick panels are not beat up, the heater control panels real nice, has LED uh, lights in the instruments too. Motor runs smooth. That's a nice idol. So I call this a no frills, just thrills. There's no uh, cruise control, no air conditioning, no fancy stuff like that. You got a 400, a four speed, and a 390 Posi and a GTO. Go out and have some fun with it. Go to volocars.com. Plenty of ways on there to contact us. We'd be more than happy to answer questions. You need more pictures, more video, whatever it may be, just let us know. We can help with the shipping and the financing as well at volocars.com. If you enjoy watching the videos, subscribe to the YouTube channel, click on the bell icon to so be the first to see them as they come out. Appreciate you watching and hope you come back for more.